hello welcome back to my channel it's been a long time so i want to tell you guys about my newfound skill um on what i've been doing for the past six months why i have actually been off youtube at the beginning of the year i decided to you know do data analysis uh, not data analysis data science and I noticed that I would need Java for um, detailed analysis so I looked um, I searched online um, you know I was not understanding you know because I am from um, because it's been long I left school you know and funny enough I studied mass and statistics in Poli and I did economics um, in Unilag you know so I knew I I knew that data science is something I would actually do because it um, involves analysis which economics has a lot of it and the math and statistics background will also help me in my you know data data sets sampling and all of that but one thing that i needed you know that um, complete data science is the aspect of computer science though we did that as a broad course but not detailed so i needed to do some coding if i want to do very well in data science so what i did after searching online for some online courses online materials to help me and though i got some but you know at that time i was still breastfeeding my second baby i was not too you know too conversant with terms I guess distractions and stress and um, you know divided attention were actually contributing to the fact that I was not understanding it. If it was a single woman, if it was you know a single like a teenager that was doing that, I'm sure the person would have grabbed a little more than I did. So I needed to you know attend the physical classes and combining the online class and i did that for six months so after i've done you know front end and back end web development from that school i noticed that data science is way more deeper than what i actually you know taught and uh, what i've done in that school though very deep and detailed was just an introductory part of coding the school was fantastic practical um you know classes you know one thing with physical classes is that you make friends you meet people that you know relate reason together you know this coding thing this programming thing is way more deeper than than i don't know so the more you look, I mean, the less you see. It's like the more you read or the more you research, the less you you see. But not in that aspect because the more you research, the more you get more information. But the, I will say the more you research, the more you realize that there are more things. So, but like right now, I know about AL. I know about PHP. I didn't know about PHP then. When I got to that school, they were not offering Java at that point. They were just focused on web development like HTML, CSS, JavaScript, the Django Python for web development. It's not Python for data analysis. So um, I was advised to start from the scratch, which is the HTML, CSS, JavaScript, um, before I can learn the Java itself. So which I um, accepted. So I started doing the 
um, these three programming language. No, is it three? HTML, CSS, um, JavaScript, JavaScript, the Django, and Python. Okay, I did five programming language them, and it was actually a huge success. I love the fact that I was able to get myself conversant with um, programming language because it was not my field honestly I didn't even know apart from this uh, computer science basis uh, all those small, small things that we learned the theoretical part of computer science not just not even the coding part um, I didn't know anything about coding so at the end of the classes I was able to you know, you know, grab a lot. After that, I needed to, to move to the primary thing that brought me there, which is data science. So, um, luckily for me, I got a place to do internship. And when I got there, it was as if I've not done anything. It was as if I've not done anything. Though he, he, I had some background, which really helped me to get into that place, helping me to um, integrate with my colleagues. Um, it's, help, it's actually helping me to, to understand more new programming languages that um, I was you know, being trained on. Like, I'm learning React, React Native. I'm also learning AL, um, CRM, ERP, Microsoft um, Business Central. Uh, I got to know about all this that I used to make business solutions that uh, you know helps in um, solving dynamic business problems. You know, and I'm so grateful for that. Before that, my channel was just all about business finance um, but now i will have to add tech because it's a beautiful you know skill to have so going forward you're going to be seeing videos on business tech finances a little more on tech you know so i'm going to bring in all my experience my skills um new skills i've acquired and what my journey and a lot of things you know about this my new journey in here and it's going to be every Tuesday every week so I would just like to encourage anyone that wants to go into tech because tech is just like the new oil money right like I used to hear that tech now is new oil money apart from healthcare that also has largest um, job markets Tech also is growing and there are a lot of, you know, companies seeking for business solutions, you know, in a dynamic ways. So tech is also a field that you can actually, you know, try on. It doesn't, um, it doesn't matter how old you are. It doesn't matter if you have been in other um, field. It's something you can actually learn you know and you have to dedicate yourself if you want to really do that so if you like my journey so far and you want some advice or you want anything any information at all you can drop your question on the comment box or follow me on instagram i'm going to drop my handle on my instagram so you can dm me if you want a personal um conversation you can dm me not on Facebook, only on Instagram. If you're new to my channel, so I'm going to say welcome. And I'm also going to ask you that you subscribe so that it will actually help my YouTube, you know. And also click the notification bell so that you'll be notified anytime I upload new videos. Um, thank you for watching.